Right? Just you're taking a little bit longer. You see, you're not as quick to get from A to B as what you need to be. So you need to just try and get here earlier and indicate the turn earlier and then you can move away a bit more, which will free free that up. Same thing there. Is your late, that's why the rail came down. It's late getting there and late in the turn. So you gotta you gotta move through, don't you gotta move through there and get to this point. This is your job to get get to these points. Yeah, you know, in time. As he's coming into that position there, you need to be sort of indicating the, the change as he's coming into commitment. If he commits, then you can start to move away again. Then move away and get forward. Like he turns, turn, is turning really, really nicely. Like he turns, he's really responsive and turns well. Just you've just got to try and do it again. You've just got to try and get to the position. Um, you know, indicate yeah. the change. Oh, yeah. It's recording. Oh, okay. That's, yeah, that's, 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 that's why. Yeah. I mean, um, yeah, well, you can't. Spin. You watch it on video. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. That front cross through here again. I think the rail came down. This rail came down because the front cross timing is possibly thinking that he's going straight ahead. And then you front cross and thought, oh, we're changing direction. And hence why the rail came down. Once he commits to number 12, if you go and do the front cross, you need to get ahead and reconnect with him through the, through the jump as he's coming to into, in, into commitment or about to jump. So if he's over the bar, as you start to jump, you know, as, if he's over the bar before you start to do your front cross, you're too late. You know, and that's why... And the other, because he's, he's actually thinking that he's probably doing that jump there. You need to do your, um, you need to do your, you need to be ahead of him. So when he's at this point here, you need to be starting to do your front cross in this, in this segment through here. If you do, if you do your front cross too early, you'll, he should pull off that, off this jump. Okay. So go back. Good weaves, and yeah, start again. Good weaves, do that segment through there. Look at you, you keep trying to get your timing right. Right through here, get up here, get up ahead more, do your front cross, and through the. Oh, See, yeah. a little bit early. Nice and early. Yeah, that's right. Let's try again. Get from 12. Oh, nice. Oh, tight. Yeah, nice. Very nice. Okay, so that was too bad. It was better. Um, through there. Um, here again is just something you're going to probably work on a little bit and focus more on your timing of things and not so much watch them um, but try and get yourself into a, a better position um, and just try and get those the, you know those turns or those front crosses and controlling the turns and maybe a little bit of maybe a little bit of um, uh, I mean, he's got quite the weave, so I mean, you can see them in the weaves. Um, and if you, like, you are quite a long way ahead of him through here, you know, you are ahead. So all you've got to do is, instead of instead of uh, helping him find the stump, you know, um, once you've reconnected him coming out of the weeds, show him that jump and then move forward. And then get, get, get to this point, and even if you just, you know, do there, reward, you know, rewarding your leg, and do that bit, reward the leg, and then be careful that you're not, you're not getting too wide through here, this one here, you, it was better, but there again, you started to, you started to drift a little bit wide, as opposed to trying to maintain tight, tight line, you know, they can turn well, you know, so it doesn't need to go wide, so it's not just turn on you, Maintaining a good position, 
getting there on time and controlling the turn and maybe just you know, a little bit of reward here just to put some value into, into that and just breaking it down a little bit for yourself as well and just sort of breaking things down. That 12, 13, 14 ends up, we, we got it right in the end here. It was good. Timing was good. Therefore, he understood where he was going to it. It was all nice and smooth. Yeah. Um, so first time you were late, the next part of the rail came down. Second time you were too early, and third time you got it right. So that, I mean, it's good because it shows you the, dif um, the differences between two being too late and too early and finding your middle ground. It also shows you where, where that point is. Yeah? That's cool. Thank you.